the yeah. EU message will be that like was uh, really creating what it was expected to, uh, a very strong training network uh, with a lot of output. On top of that, I would like to stress our collaboration with the other three ITNs in wind energy that ran in parallel. We have not just had 15 PhD students, we have had a group of 60 PhD students that have got to know each other, they are on LinkedIn and other uh, social media together and they will have their network forever. At the Deep Wind Conference in Norway, we all talked about how much more offshore wind we have to establish in a very short time, and that there are bottlenecks, uh, lack of ships, lack of turbines, lack of blah, blah, blah. But I think like and the other three ITNs on wind energy, they are the human resource behind establishing a really build out of wind energy for the future. Without these skills, we won't make it. Even if we have all the turbines or all the ships, we need the human resource. Another a part of the LIKE project, by the way, is that it was very interdisciplinary. It is not only about the wind lighters, it's also about how to use it in, in, in a lot of constellations. Uh, and uh, this say uh, multidisciplinarity is, is so important. I would say, because we have been very strongly dependent on the industrial secondments, um, that we have achieved even stronger links, enabling us to move ahead and uh, several of those of, of the students already have jobs, good jobs in industry. Others will of course go for academia, but the majority we, I expect will be in industry very soon and working on how the wind lighters can be integrated into industrial application.